Right now, this stage is empty and silent, but come tomorrow, lights, music and bubbles will fill the air as the Lancaster community comes together to celebrate the 16th annual Pride Festival. Yes, that's, that's the plan. Okay. Do you not want them there? From early in the morning until late at night on Friday, organizers, vendors and volunteers all gathered with one purpose to turn this space and this year the entirety of Vine Street into a pride festival unlike any other. People were concerned that we weren't visible enough and that we were hiding indoors. So we tried to find a way that we can make it fun, safe and just enjoyable for everybody. In March, the Lancaster Library received threats ahead of its scheduled Drag Queen Story Hour. Because of this, festival organizers have arranged for extra security on Saturday. We're doing everything we can to keep everybody safe. We have an extensive security plan. Even though the festival only runs for one day, organizers stress pride in itself is never ending. As much as we've seen the LGBTQ plus movement uh, move forward over the last 50 years, there is still a struggle that is very real in 2024. Pride is 365, whether that is a, uh, being your authentic self or understanding that we need to stand up for everyone in our community. The festival kicks off tomorrow at noon and runs until seven. Entrance to the main event is $5, but if you'd like to attend the after party here at nine, it'll cost $15. In Lancaster, for WJL News 8, I'm McKenna Alexander.